In this lesson, we'll learn how to clean up our geometry after we've modified them, and we'll uh, learn how to use the extend and trim command. Now, extend and trim command let us to clean up our geometry and correct them after we have uh, made some changes to them. Now, I have a simple shape right here that we're, uh, it's going to be used as our exercise drawing and uh, this is a circle that I don't need the, these lines inside of it I want them to be deleted so I'm going to launch the trim command from the modify panel and uh, uh, take a look at my uh, command line before that it says select cotton edges I want to select this circle this circle is going to be used as a cotton edge that uh, after they selecting that uh, whichever of these uh, uh, edges I select is going to be deleted and uh, till this circle so let's see it in action I'm going to select it right click and uh, click these edges delete and it's going to be deleted very easily I'm going to press escape to deselect out of them let's say we changed our mind we wanted uh, this circle to be smaller than it is. I'm going to select that circle, go to my property changer, and take my uh, that radius down to five, and enter, and escape. Now instead of my, my line here to be too uh, long, they're too short. I want to project those lines to meet uh, the circle here and for that I'm going to launch the extend command which shares the same uh, menu with the trim I'm going to launch that I'm going to select the circle but before that let's take a look at my command line it says select boundary edges now this circle and the lower the line uh, I'm going to select Instead of uh, being a cutting edge, it's going to be used as a stopping point for our geometry that uh, it's going to be projected. I'm going to select this circle, right click, and click, click, and another one. It's going to project it very nicely. And let's uh, work with these extend and trim to learn about them a little more now I've got some very basic line works then I want to turn them into a ladder I'm going to launch my extend command right there I'm going to select these two lines and the right click I'm going to extend this this one the other one and this one and I can go to the menu and uh, deselect out of this and select the trim command come and trim these uh, but take a look at my command line which says select object to extend or shift select to trim so we can uh, we can change the command that we've selected right now uh, into the trim by just pressing and uh, holding the shift button and it's the trim now let's see if it works I'm going to trim this yes it does very easily now I'm going to press the escape button let's use this in some practical example uh, the example we've got here is uh, our two windows that this one is supposed to end up uh, like the other window completed and we're going to do that line works now first of all we're going to make that 
upper part I'm going to launch the circle command as you see the diameter is 39 and we're going to select the midpoint and uh, right click diameter and the diameter is going to be 39 so 39 and enter there it is we launch the circle one more time and from center of this circle I'm going to create another circle take a look at here this circle is going to be one and a half uh, unit smaller than the outer circle so if this is 39 that's going to be maybe one and a half less but let's take a look at my command line which tells us the exact uh, radius of our line and it's 19 and a half unit so this line should be 18 units so I'm going to enter 18 and enter there we go now let's delete these uh, lines that we don't need I'm going to go to trim and select this line right here right click and delete this and delete this here now escape to deselect out of that we're going to press the spacebar one more time and this time we're going to select this one and uh, right click delete these two escape to get out of that now let's extend these lines I'm going to go and uh, select the extend and we're going to select this line right here right click and extend these right here and here I'm going to press escape and look at this right here I'm going to select trim and uh, we need to trim all these little lines right here and uh, look at my command line it says select cut images select objects or select all I'm going to press enter and all these lines are the cutting edges. I'm going to delete these and now I'm done. I'm going to take a look at it. Very nice. Trim and extend are very useful commands that we probably use them a lot.